Faraday's a bit of a fox. He's a trickster. He he's lighthearted. He is a gambler, a drinker. You know, he's a cigar smoker. He loves the ladies, and but he's and he, but he's deadly. He's deadly in a firefight, and he's really calm and cool in a firefight. The diversity of the Magnificent Seven, it feels contemporary. We've got a really strong female character who's not just the girl and the damsel in distress. She's actually deadly and, and a complicated person who's three-dimensional. And we've got uh, an African-American male as the lead of, of a, a band of gunslingers in the late 1880s. And this, is, this, is, this story is as old as time, but also very timely as well. There are 25 buildings built, a church, livery, stable that's fully functional. We have 90 horses. We have 500 crewmen. We've got hundreds of stuntmen every single day here. Real dust, real heat, real sweat, a lot of real blood, some real tears. This is, they've created an authentic town. Everything you see is real. There's no CG here. Uh, apart from the mountains that they've created to make it look like Northern California because we're in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. So there will be some mountains digitally uh, put in there. But as far as the town goes, every bit of wood, every horse you see, every bit of costume, this is all real stuff. It's a story of seven warriors who are coming to the aid of a town and learning through the process to respect something more than their own power. Hey, I've got a movie fact for you. Did you know that Darth Vader only has 12 minutes of screen time in the original Star Wars? Mm. For this and more movie facts, click on more videos. Or for more trailers, click on the playlist. <laughs>